This is a video to give you some help in transferring files from your computer to your tablet. Um, first thing you need to do is hook up your tablet to your computer and this is a picture I took showing you using your charging cord you plug it in as you normally would you remove the AC adapter from the other end which leaves you this USB plug and you plug that into any USB port in your computer so that would be what your hookup would look like and your tablet should connect same as if you just plugged in a thumb drive uh, some of them don't if they don't uh, what you need to do is from your main screen on your tablet just take your finger and swipe down from the top and you'll bring down a whole bunch of notifications one of them will say may say connected as a mobile as an immediate device it may say connected as a USB charging device but if you click on it uh, it'll say touch for other USB options if you click on it and then choose file transfer then that will allow your computer to be able to talk to your tablet um, then the next thing you want to do uh, and by the way I'm running Windows 7 in this video you want to go down in the left corner and click on your explore function. If you're running Windows 10, it'd be very it would be the same. You just click on the explore function and you should near the bottom see the tablet. Mine's an SMP900. So there's my tablet. If I click the little arrow to the left, it tells me within that tablet I have a card and tablet memory. You can just ignore the tablet memory and always deal with the card. If I click on the little arrow to the left of the card, shows me all the file folders I have on the card and this demo I'm going to use Coral Society so if I click on the arrow to the left of my Coral Society folder which I've created on there uh, you can see that I have mp3 file folders and then I have uh, for example here Waynesburg Coral Society Spring 2017 those are PDF files in there um, if I click on it you can see these are the PDF files that are the current spring music. So just to show you how to create a folder, I'm going to just do a test folder. So what you want to do is uh, click on the Williamsburg Coral Society, kind of the master folder, and you see on the right side of your screen it brings up everything that's in there. Then you want to just stay hovered over here over this and right click and well that's, I'll take it back, it won't work if you do it over there on 7. You come over to this side of the screen and click once right click you have to get up here where the folders are well somewhere here there's an option for a new folder yeah there we go it's just a quirk in this computer and you can see down here in the bottom uh, it's asked me well what do I want to name it I'm just going to name it test and hit enter key and then if you look on the left side, you can see then now there's a new folder in, in the Waynesboro Coral Society master folder called test. So now what you want to do is find the music file, the PDF file, that goes into that folder. And in this case, what I did is I keep mine stored in music. So I'll go up here and click on music and it brings up all my music folders. I'll click on Coral Society Music Files over here, double click it, and I have a test PDF in the Spring folder, so I'll double click that and open it up, and you see there's a PDF file that says Test for Training Mobile Sheets. That could be Hallelujah, it could be the Old Rugged Cross, whatever it is. Just click once on it and select it. Then, I'm going to drag this down so I can see it then you can right click you can either right click or drag I tend to right click and copy then you simply bring your cursor over here on the folder you want to put it into which in this case is test and while you're hovering over it you right click and paste so now if I click on this test folder lo and behold I have that music file in there. If I open it up, it's just a single sheet of music I copied actually from um, a Faithful Man song. But you can see that's, that's the PDF file, so that's one you'll see in your tablet. So that's basically how you do it. Um, at this point then, 
you can go to your tablet and use the import uh, function in the Mobile Sheets Pro to bring this uh, piece of music that you put in just put into this folder then you can import it into Mobile Sheets which is in the tablet memory it's there now on the external chip but you need to go to Mobile Sheets and import it from this folder into the app memory which will be done down in here uh, and that's done automatically so uh, and if you have any questions let me know hope this helps